Here at home, get ready for this now. Brace yourself. Texas is looking to widen a busy highway. You should say busy in East Texas, taking part of Old Jacksonville Highway from four lanes to six. They say it'll ease traffic. KDK's Avery Kalowski spoke with Tex Todd and business owners along the busy highway and joined us now more live with more about that. What are people telling you, Avery? Neil, tomorrow Tex Todd will have a meeting at Tyler Junior College. They want to hear from drivers and business owners how they're feeling about widening a part of Old Jacksonville Highway. Tex Todd is planning to expand Old Jacksonville Highway to six lanes widening the road from Loop 323 to Farm to Market Road 2813. Construction will impact people in the area. The owner of Sign Country, which is located south of this project, knows this. Well, the construction itself is going to put a hindrance on um, traffic. Uh, our customers are, are going to be more apprehensive about driving out here to pick up their products. The length of the project is five and a half miles from the busy Tyler Loop into the community of Gresham. As everyone knows, Tyler, uh, East Texas is growing and so, uh, you know, everyone knows South Broadway Avenue. That's a that's a major corridor. Well, Old Jacksonville is uh, kind of runs parallel with that roadway and so a lot of people use it for, for traveling from north to south. According to Texas, in 2019, about 32,000 vehicles traveled the road every day. This will expand it to six lanes uh, with a raised median and, and turn uh, lanes into certain businesses in certain areas. And so one, it'll help with safety uh, uh, improvements and, and mobility as well. Construction for this project is set to begin in 2026. We're going to be right in the middle of the construction from Flint all the way down to Bullard, so we're, there's not going to be an easy access to us. So it's going to be, like I said, we have to get creative and, and figure out ways to keep our customers happy. So people along the highway are already looking for solutions once the work begins. So I've told my team that we're going to have to um, get creative, uh, maybe a courier service or, or delivery uh, to our customers so they don't have to go through the hassle of coming out here. Making East Texas roads safer and better for traffic as the region continues to grow. The meeting will happen tomorrow evening at TJC West at 5. It is open to the public but will be the last one before they move forward to the next phase. Reporting in Tyler, Avery Kanowski, KETK News. The construction, how many years will it take?